Oke, okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel again. Hari ini ada satu produk unboxing ya. Eh. This is from Adams Digital. Okey, dari casing boleh nampak dia agak fancy ya. Eh. It's quite a fancy box and also quite a fancy speaker. So this is Adams Digital Empire series, one of the yang top range punya model lah untuk Adams Digital. Okay, so it's a three-way setup. So you have mid bass, you have mid range, and you have the tweeter. Okay, so let's buka the box like that. This reminds me of the DLS Scandinavia, and there you go. Beautifully done. All right. So mid bass. This is the mid bass speaker. Okay, and. Yeah, it's 89 dB sensitivity, which is um, not bad. It's quite on the moderate level side because my DLS punya sensitivity is about 86 or 85. So this is much more sensitive, meaning you tak perlukan banyak power untuk uh, gerak dia lah. Okay, so it's, it, it doesn't really require much power. Ideally, kalau if you are looking at a speaker spec and sensitivity dia lebih dari 90, that is best lah okay that means you don't really need amplifier to move them around okay so this is the mid base and we go to the mid range now okay so this is the mid range it's a three inch in here like three inch eh? all right so this is a three inch mid range i'm not sure about the specs on this i don't know whether I... oh dudum tak goyak okay tak apa jom kita mm, okay let's just tear this out and see Tak ada juga, dia tak tulis So I don't know the specs on the mid range As for now Maybe I do an installation Nanti kita boleh tengok lah Dapat full spec dia Kita boleh Kita boleh tengok lah Apa yang boleh berlaku kat sini And this one Is the Twitter So this is their flagship model eh. Okay and this is a full active system Maksudnya Tak ada passive crossover box dan bagainya Dia tak bagi So this is Cara nak install ni, kena pakai um, DSP atau amplifier stand alone. Untuk set ni lah, kalau nak beli asing, uh, ada crossover dia. Okay, but I tak recommend if you are doing a three-way, I always recommend untuk buat active. So you get the most, um, you know, experience out of it lah because... If you're using passive, how are you going to tune your Twitter? How are you going to tune your mid range? How are you going to do your mid bass? Because um, one more thing, kita punya distance uh, to speaker, you know, it's different. So about passenger line, driver line. So you cannot level match it with a passive system. Okay, it's just not going to happen. But I know certain cars, certain installers, they can do it. But I just don't like that way lah. All right. So this is it. This is the Adams Digital Empire Series three-way setup. So harganya, uh, I mean, it's quite um, bizarre when I dengar harga speaker ni eh, sebab dia tak mahal sebenarnya. Actually, it's very very affordable. Okay, cuma nya um, your your installation akan bertambah sedikit sebab now you need a custom pillar. To put the Twitter and mid range and I mean mid base dekat pintu biasa lah itu biasa lah installation kan okay but yeah you're gonna spend on wires a bit and you're gonna spend on pillars a bit uh, installation blah 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 yeah that's another story okay so untuk speaker ni harga speaker ni okay is actually 2500 ringgit Malaysia sahaja okay you get mid bass you get mid range and you get your tweeter this, so this is a full three way active punya set for that price i believe it's fucking amazing okay memang susah nak dapat uh, untuk harga tu but I'm, I'm not sure about crossfire though uh, because i i opt for this because i nampak dia macam oh, okay not bad let's just give it a try so i took it and other customers sudah beli benda ni and I'm going to install this on a Pro 2 Axia. Okay, this, this set is going on an Axia with Adams Digital uh, 10 channel DSP. So it's going to be a full active system. And I will most definitely, I can record too. And I'll put it on YouTube so you can see lah. Okay, 
So hope this video ringkas ni membantu and I see you guys in the next one.